who's had a chance to look at Romeo and Juliet since last week? <laughs> anybody? No. Uh, uh, well, I know, you know, you've all been busy. It's difficult to make time. But uh, anybody at all? No. OK, good. Right, so you're, you're all coming to it fresh. That's probably better, in fact. In fact, well done. Good. Um, right, now, uh, first of all, th uh, this is Mr Lewis. He's just popped in to see how we're all getting on. Uh, just ignore him. Uh, well, don't ignore him, but, uh, you know. Uh, well, here, here's an interesting one. I wonder, who can tell me what ignore means? Anyone tell me what ignore means? <laughs> Nobody. Right. OK. Uh, ignore means um, uh, not to pay too much attention to something, not to be all, all that... Uh, Tony, wake up. Uh, thanks. Uh, not to be all that bothered by something. Uh, if you like, Tony was ignoring me just then, OK? So, so that's ignore. Right. Uh, well, who'd like me to write it down? Should we write it down? Hands up. Who'd like me to write it down? Ignore. <laughs> no one. OK, so we're happy with ignore. Good. All right, then. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Rosie, it's, uh, it's B-A-S-T-A-R-D. Yeah? <laughs> Otherwise, good. Um, <laughs> right. Now, Romeo and Juliet. Uh, what do you think? Should, should we talk about it first and then read it? Or, 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 I mean, hands up who'd like to talk about it first. <laughs> no. OK, well, I agree. Let's, let's just get straight in and read it, for heaven's sake. Um, I always like to get them involved as soon as possible. OK, so, <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Um, do we have a Juliet? Who'd like to read Juliet? Anybody? Anybody like to... What about a Romeo? I mean, we've got to have a Romeo, yeah? A couple of Romeos. Maybe what? One, one Romeo, eh? Uh, no. OK, fine. I'll, I'll, I'll read them both, because then you can get a chance to... <laughs> this is Juliet speaking, right? Uh, uh, Wilt thou be gone? It's not yet, yet near day. Uh, it was the nightingale, not the lark, um, uh, uh, that pierced the, the fearful hollow of thine ear. Um, nightly she sings on yon pomegranate tree. <laughs> Believe me, love, it was the nightingale. Uh, this is Romeo now. Um, it was the lark, the herald of the morn, no nightingale. Look, love, what envious streaks do lace the severing clouds in yonder east. OK, now, whew. Um, right. <laughs> so, having heard that, from what you've just heard, what relevance do you think Romeo and Juliet has to today's Britain? Who, who thinks it's got any, any, any relevance at all? No one. OK, right. So, so we think it's irrelevant, do we? Ah, uh, interesting. Right, so nobody... We don't think it's relevant. We don't think it's irrelevant either, yeah? It's sort of, it's sort of in between, yeah? It's in a kind of a grey area. Now, it's interesting. Good, well done. Um, so why do you think... Why do you think Shakespeare wrote something that was in a grey area? What did he mean by it? Did he mean anything by it? Or maybe he's just, just being stupid. Um, who thinks that? Hands up those people who think Shakespeare was being stupid. No, so, all oh, right, no, that was stupid. No, that, I was being stupid. So we don't think Shakespeare was stupid. But he was writing in a grey area. Why? All right, why do you all think about that one? I'm just going to come out with an opinion. <laughs> it is just an opinion, so you can all shout me down as usual. Um, and that is that R Romeo and Juliet is about love. Uh, we have love, we do love in today's Britain. So Romeo and Juliet, therefore, isn't, wasn't, irrelevant. <laughs> what do you think about that? Any, any, anybody agree with that? Right, no, so nobody agrees with it, but did anyone find it helpful at all? <laughs> nobody. Right. No, you're right. I, yeah. I was being unhelpful there. Oh, that's stupid of me. I shouldn't. <laughs> I've just got, I've just clouded the whole issue now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just holding you back. Um, well, who'd like me to stay? I mean, hands up those people who'd like me to stay. Would you like me to? <laughs> no one. Right. I, I, no, I agree. I agree, you're right. I, I'm sorry. 